Abdul, this uh, question is related to the truce of uh, Hudaybiyah. When um, terms and conditions of truce were settled, then the initial uh, words were like this, that uh, this is a treaty or truce between uh, the Quraysh of Mecca and Muhammad Rasulullah. Suddenly the leader of Quraysh, um, so he protested that uh, we don't believe you to be Rasulullah, so naturally it should be omitted. And Huzur sallallahu alayhi wa immediately instructed that to omit Rasulullah, just uh, write Muhammad son of Abdullah. Khalid Bhai wants to know uh, Huzur's uh, opinion about this. Uh, I mean, my opinion can't, can't be different from that of Muhammad Rasulullah. I, I mean, uh, so he's already expressed his opinion, and that's all. Uh, th th that action of Huzur sallallahu alaihi wasallam, how Huzur will interpret it. Well, that shows a great uh, secular approach when you meet enemies who do not believe, believe in anything. So between, if there is going to be, if there was going to be a real peace contract, naturally the demand of the opposition, all right, it, if they believe in him to be Rasulullah, there won't be any contact or anything. There was just one thing at that in that case. So principally he was right. Or Rasulullah should never have accepted it. The acceptance of Rasulullah proves that uh, he was definitely right his claim. The wrong in the essence, but in his uh, bargaining claim he was right.